Hey guys, Ruth William back with you again, your realtor here in the city of Glendale. July 9th, we just closed us on this property for $2,720,000. This is a must, must, must see home. Uh, we've shot a lot of videos in the past for the homes that we sold, but this one was definitely one that I was really excited to do. And here we are, 1616 Wabasso Way in the city of Glendale. Five bedrooms, six bathrooms, over 3,900 in square footage, uh, lot size over 31,000 in square footage. Uh, you can see the house behind me. It's absolutely breathtaking. Congratulations to Tico and Isabella on this beautiful, beautiful home. Uh, you guys definitely have a one-of-a-kind home. I want you guys to see how, how big this lot is. You definitely do not have to worry about space when it comes to this home. Uh, rather, you have to worry about what to do with all that space. You'll see some smoke in the background. It's not a fire. It's uh, actually the neighbor uh, uh, cooking some delicious barbecue. So uh, as the camera moves to the left, uh, you got the black picket fence, uh, very private. The curb appeal on this house is just breathtaking. A lot of beautiful homes in the neighborhood, um, on, on you know, on, on this block. But this this one definitely takes the cake. Uh, those of you who know Glendale, at some point or another, you might have known someone that has talked about this house, or you might have passed by this house. So uh, follow me, guys. Let's go through the driveway. A fairly long driveway, fairly wide uh, driveway. We got two entryways uh, from the driveway. I'm gonna have Jay follow me. We got one entryway by the car, another one over here. I mean, the amount of trees, the amount of palm trees, the just just the landscaping is beautiful. Um, here's the second walkway uh, on my right. Uh, you got a little nice uh, seating area to your left over here. Uh, I believe the previous owners had some uh, outdoor patio furniture they might have taken with them. Uh, we got a fairly wide door. And we are officially inside this beautiful uh, home. Uh, we got a nice pile fireplace here, beautiful wood mantle. As I show you this home, I want you to pay attention to the craftsmanship, uh, to the woodwork uh, on this home because this home is literally probably 99% you know, all wood in its exterior, in its interior, the design, just, just everything about it. Um, you got nice blinds over here. You can see uh, on my left, there's a lot of windows on this house. I think we spoke with the owner and he said it's something over you know, 50, 60 windows, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I haven't counted each one of them, but there's a lot of windows. Before I show you guys the kitchen where we're gonna actually exit out to the backyard, I wanna show you uh, this space over here. I think they probably had a pool table here because I can see the setup happening right on the wall. Uh, you got like an informal uh, seating area, you got a TV mount, which, uh, you know, they, they took uh, another fireplace here, so the second fireplace over here, and then follow me, we're actually going to just go right around this wall, and I want to show you guys uh, the second floor uh, before we go to the kitchen. So again, uh, original wood flooring here, a lot of wood. Uh, you know, craftsmanship here, the stairs, all wood. Um, and then, once we go all the way up to the second floor, I want to show you this beautiful uh, chandelier here. It's definitely a beautiful piece. Um, as the camera kind of goes back, you guys can see the size of it. It's probably like seven feet in height or six feet in height from where I'm standing. Um, back here is one of the bedrooms. We're not going to show you all the bedrooms, but I like this uh, room here specifically. Just because it sits on the corner, um, and you're able to see the entire uh, backyard uh, from here. They used it as an office. You got the nice wood uh, desk happening here. I'm gonna show you guys the bathroom. It's all remodeled, how beautiful it is, and how large it is. I mean, I'm gonna have the camera guy go on that side. Guys, look at the size of the shower. I mean, if I extend my hands, I'm literally touching from end to end. And you got that European system drain happening on the bottom. Pile flooring, huge glass uh, doors. Two shower heads, I'm not sure if you can see it from here, but we got one shower head right over here. We got another shower head over here. And um, look at the, I mean, first of all, the, the, the tub is definitely beautiful. A lot of modern, um, uh, you know, fixtures here. And look at the black splash here, guys. Beautiful black splash. I looked at uh, the, the, the color combination. Look at this over here. Beautiful. So 
follow me this way. We have another bedroom over here. Again, it's five bedrooms, six bathrooms. This is the master bedroom, right? I'm not gonna ruin all the surprise, but first I wanna show you guys the bathroom over here as well. So again, huge, huge shower. Look at the tile work here, guys. I don't know if you can really see it on camera, but uh, I personally haven't seen this before. It's really, really, really nice. Uh, again, you got your black fixtures here, European uh, style shower, two heads again. This one is actually much, much larger. I can't even touch both ends as I extend my hand. So uh, I love the size of this shower, guys. Those of you who have kids, Definitely want to throw everyone in there and knock it all out. <laughs> I got three kids, so I know it's a savior. This is not a bedroom, this is actually a walk in closet. Um, I want you to see <laughs> the size of this walk in closet as well. Uh, and then again, you got nice views uh, of the exterior happening here. Um, shoe racks, the whole nine yards, all this is obviously custom built. You got uh, doors over here, you got doors on the left side as you walk in, uh, and then you got a shoe rack in that corner right over there, which we're not gonna show, uh, I'm not gonna show you, but maybe the camera can get some angles of that. And check this out, guys. This is, uh, I'm gonna actually exit out from the master bedroom, and my favorite, 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 favorite part of the house is this. I mean, I'm gonna stand right over here so our videographer can get some shots on how large um, this space is. I mean, to walk out from the master bedroom and be able to relax here at night, uh, you know, watch the stars, uh, drink some champagne, drink some wine. Uh, a huge, huge, huge area here. We got some of the leaves that are uh, falling, so you guys can see we're literally right under a tree. It's beautiful. There's there's no words to, to describe uh, the layout and the concept of this home. Uh, but follow me, we're gonna go downstairs. I'm gonna show you guys the kitchen, and then from the kitchen, we're gonna go to the backyard where I'll show you some of the features, such as the pool and the backyard, so follow me. So guys, as we come down the stairs, we are immediately greeted by the uh, kitchen area. As you can see, uh, nice center bar uh, or, or island, I'm sorry, right over here. Uh, we got our flat screen TV, we got a fridge, built in appliances, uh, subway tile, uh, farmhouse style sink, uh, all custom cabinetry. Um, I mean, just the whole nine yards. The ceilings are fairly high, I believe it's about maybe 10 feet in height. Uh, built-in fridge, appliances, wine cooler, uh, and then as we continue walking this way, we have a little uh, area right over here that we use, as, you know, for like a breakfast nook. Uh, I like this nice um, canvas style, uh, you know, glass that allows you to see the entire backyard. So if you got kids playing in the backyard, you got you know kids swimming over there, um, you can literally see majority of the backyard just from the kitchen area. So follow me. I mean, look at the cement uh, uh, paver, uh, stone work over here. You can't imagine how many there are, uh, but uh, as we exit out to our left, uh, you are greeted by your half-court basketball court right over here. So, so we got the paint shop done over here, we got the lines, and we got a really heavy-duty, uh, professionally installed uh, court right over there, uh, all metal. Uh, adjustable uh, is what it looks like with the crank over here. So follow me this way. Here we have a two-car uh, parking garage, uh, uh, aside from the driveway. The backyard can probably fit, I don't know, 50 cars uh, from the way I'm looking at it, including the driveway. And then we, uh, in addition to that, we have a two-car parking garage. This is the guest house area. We're not gonna go in and, and show you guys everything, but this is the guest house uh, area. And then follow me this way. Oh, this has to be one of my favorite spots right now because it's so hot outside. This is the only shady area right here. So, barbecue slash bar slash hangout slash, uh, you know, pool table area. Um, this place is huge. Um, you know, you got exposed beams right over here. Uh, fairly, fairly large, guys. You got, you know, nice uh, island over there. 
Again, built-in barbecue grill, two TVs, one to your left, one to your right. And then as we walk this way, I'm gonna have the videographer just turn around and show you guys how massive this area is. You got your pool uh, here. Um, it's, uh, it has a nice depth uh, to it. Uh, got the tile, mosaic tiles installed. Um, and we were out there showing you guys the front of the home and I hope you can see how far away that uh, you know black wood uh, picket fence is from where we're standing right now. I mean, this is a party home. This is a, um, a home that you can hold almost any event. Uh, these these are the type of homes we usually see in movies just because of the way that it's designed, just because of the uh, exterior of the home, the originality of it, the, 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 the just the design. So definitely breathtaking. It was definitely a pleasure uh, showing you this home. Uh, there's just so many components of this home that we don't have enough time to show you. Uh, but we wanted to give you a glimpse of what type of homes are out there. This one was actually listed for $3 million on the market. Uh, we were fortunate enough to uh, get our offer accepted and we negotiated our way down to $2,720,000. Uh, so we bought it for $280,000 below market value. Now in this market, you don't really, really see homes selling under market value, but we were able to uh, strike a deal on this one. Uh, congratulations again to all parties involved. Uh, and we did it for our client and our client's extremely happy. Uh, those of you who are looking to buy, those of you who are looking to sell, if you're looking to upgrade, uh, make no mistake about it guys, there really is no right time when you're looking to purchase a property that you're gonna live in. So many times we get called, um, I get a lot of DMs on Instagram asking, hey Harut, what do you think, is it the right time to buy? My personal opinion is this, if you can afford it, and you can sleep at night with the mortgage payment that you have along with all the other expenses that you have, then yes, it is time to buy. But if you're gonna go out on a limb, you're gonna put every penny that you have and make ends meet paycheck to paycheck, then absolutely not. Um, I would definitely wait. But if you can make the payments, do it. One big thing that I'm a huge believer in is this. Um, I have three children uh, and uh, I understand what parents go through on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, kids are getting older, uh, you know, we're getting older with them and time's flying by. If you're going to wait 10, 15 years, uh, which I know a lot of clients that have waited 10, 15 years and they're still waiting to see if the market drops and when that right time is, events are passing by, birthdays are passing by, uh, life is just too short in my opinion uh, to waste on saving 500 to $600 a month on payments. Uh, rather, uh, I would get into a home so I can enjoy my life, enjoy the gatherings. So guys, uh, don't worry about what's happening to the left of you, to the right of you, what your friends or family or anyone else is saying. Listen to yourself, listen to what you want for yourself and your family. Um, and if you feel like you can afford the payments, then buy, do not wait. Enjoy your life, it's too short. I'll say it once and I'll say, it. I've said it once and I'll say it again. Um, don't think too much guys. Uh, we're blessed to have our health. Uh, we're blessed to you know, be uh, able to go back to work. Everyone's kind of going back to work. We're seeing places fill up more, restaurants, so on and so forth. So this is almost like our second chance uh, you know, in life is the way that I kind of see it. Uh, we kind of had a pause to spend some time with our family, really appreciate what we have. Again, I would love, love, love to earn your business. Feel free to give me a call, guys, 818-522-5280. Uh, I am very, very, very good at what I do. Uh, I don't mean that in a bragging sense, but um, I am really passionate about what I do and I appreciate all the referrals that are coming from my clients. So uh, thank you to everyone who uh, is watching this video right now. If there's any which way that I can help you, please feel free to give me a call again, 818-522-5280. And most importantly, if you are not following me on social media, please do so at Sold by Harut for the latest deals and updates. I post something almost every single day, so you definitely don't want to miss uh, anything that's coming on. Uh, with that said, guys, I'm off to my next appointment. I will see you. Have a wonderful day. Stay safe and stay healthy, everyone. Bye, everyone.